Hi guys, um, th this is a continuation of the video I put out the other day when we did a comparison of uh, Yip Man Wing Chun and uh, Good Alpine Sam Wing Chun and the differences in the way that we move and open up sets. Um, as mentioned before, we had 12 standard sets um, and then we had 5 additional sets or, or 5 additional hands. Uh, so it's a total of 17 sets um, which are basically 17 principles that we work all our concepts off of as opposed to having three handfuls of Sin Lung Tao, Chum and Bill G. Um, so anyway, we, we touched on the first part. Uh, the first set is, is basically uh, two parts really, uh, or the way that we look at it. And the way that we teach it, we teach it in two parts. Uh, the, the, the first part obviously is what we showed the other day and this is dealing with sinking and rising or the principle of sinking and rising. Um, the concepts or some of the applications that we use that for is for destroying an opponent's guard uh, or shock entry. Um, the, 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 the second part of the first set, um, the major principle that we're working on uh, is one, obviously, uh, the punch, uh, and two, uh, one hand defends while the other hand uh, attacks. Now, I'll go straight into that. What I do is, first of all, I demonstrate the way that we open up uh, Yip Man uh, lineage Wing Chun and the way that we punch uh, in that in the first segment or, or the first section of uh, Sin Lung Tap. So this is the way that we open up within Yip Man. And then the three punches, yeah? So, pretty similar to the, the way everyone else does it. Uh, we have three punches at the beginning of three rapid punches. Some people um, have one punch coming over, one punch coming over, and then obviously, you know, go into the next section. Um, the way that we open up um, the second part of the first set within Gulel Pinsan is different. The punching is different as well. So, I'll break that down. Basically, we're getting to stance because we're already there. Uh, and we open it up the same way that we opened up the first part. So we, we come out with the right hand on top. From there, we raise it up into a Wu Sao with the back hand ready in punch position, which I'll show here. Okay. Now, instead of punching over, we punch under. So we go one, two, three. Okay. Now, the complete set in itself would now look like this. And, I, and I'll show you. So we open up. Again, we slightly sink. We come in, double Wu Sao, and slightly rise. We sink, we rise. We sink, we rise, we sink. And on the fourth one, we push out, double fat, back fist. From there, we come out, one punch, two punch, on the last punch, we pull back, shoot the fingers out, and we use snake hands. We go one, two, three, open, open, one, two, three. Okay, now that's the first set. Now, as you can see, um, as mentioned before, we use the principle of four door three level. Okay, so four angles, not including center line. So 90 degree, 45, 45, 90 degree. And then we use uh, three levels, which is high, middle, low. So as you can see, um, if, we, if, we, if we apply that concept to what we're doing in the sets, we can use all these levels and we can use all these angles to do that. So I don't necessarily need to be punching straight in, okay? I can come over, I can come over to this angle. I don't need to punch underneath either because I've got three levels that I can punch from. So I can punch uh, high, I can punch middle, or I can punch low. And again, I can do that on all of these angles, okay? So I hope that helps uh, and explains it a little bit of the differences between the two styles. Um, again, if you have any questions, please ask. Um, if you want us to, um, to film in more detail, we can do that. Um, ideally, the, the best way to actually see these concepts or these principles working is when we go on to the next stage, and that's when we use two-person uh, sets. Now, the next class we've got is on Sunday. What I'll try and do is I will film the first set, um, both parts, 
and then film them in the two man uh, sets as well. So you can actually see these principles and these concepts working. Okay, um, as I said, any questions, get in touch. Thank you very much.